Hello everyone, Blue Kibo here. Today I'm going to talk about a very cool feature of KeePass which has to do with synchronizing multiple databases. If you don't know what KeePass is, you can check out the video in the description. There I go over what it is, how to use it, and how to set it up. But for now I'm going to assume that you know what KeePass is. So let's say you have a database called DB right here and you make a backup of it, so just a copy, and I'm going to call this DB Backup. And let's say you put the backup somewhere on Google Drive or on another computer or a USB drive. And you only change the DB master of database. So how are you going to synchronize the changes into your backup file without having to do it, of course, manually? So KeePass provides a very cool feature for doing that. So let's say we go into the master file and then uh, we have only two entries. Uh, there right now. So let's say you want to add a new entry. I'll call it test. And on the sample entry here, I will change the password. So the password right now is password, and I will just make it 1234. Of course, this is just for demonstration purposes. So we did two changes, right? So we added a new entry, and we also changed the password on the first sample entry. And we close this and of course the backup file that was somewhere else did not uh, get these changes automatically so we need to synchronize the master file to the backup file so what we do is we open the backup file in this case they have the same password if they have different passwords just enter the password for the backup file and as you can see it only has sample entry and sample entry number two and let's see the password on sample entry it is password so it's not one two three four so of course you know uh, th these are different so we need to synchronize them but the sample entry is the same entry it just has a different password so what keepas does um, is synchronizes them and just updates the password on the entries that are the same so what you do is you go into file synchronize synchronize with file and here you select the original database so because the databases now have the same password, KeePass automatically will do the synchronization once you click open here. But if they were different, when you click open, it will ask you for the master password of that file. In this case, they're the same. So when we click open, it will automatically do the synchronization. So there it is. It did it very quickly. It only takes a fraction of a second. It added the new entry and it also hopefully change the password on the sample entry and it did it's one two three four so you might say okay what happened to my previous password what if you wanted to keep track of your previous passwords well keep as very conveniently has a history tab where it keeps track of all the usernames and passwords that you've changed in this entry and then the previous one based on the dates and so forth there it is it's password so you can go through the history and see all the changes that you've made to a specific entry without having to fear of losing any of them. So now if we save this file, now the backup file and the original file are both synchronized. So I'd highly recommend you do this with all your backups every once in a while to make sure that they're all keeping track of the same username and passwords. So in case you need to use a backup or you lose your master file, then you can um, use it just as if it was the master file. So that's it for this video. I hope you uh, got something out of it and I'll catch you in the next video. Bye bye.